Okay, this is my 7.1 and 7.2 uh, final athletic budget project. Um, so our total requested money was 153000 and we got that down to 121000 Just looking at cheerleading, um, they needed some five complete uniforms and just some simple stuff, so we were able to prove everything there. Football was a big one, um, obviously, with given the class. Um, I forgot who it was. It might have been Jared. Um, it was... $51,000 is a big, big request. And so instead of ordering 60 helmets and 60 pairs of shoulder pads, we cut that in half and went to 30. Also took away the um, five-man sled. That was a $7,000 $7, purchase, and that really helped us out here. We can always get that later on. I know it's a big need for football, but some schools don't have it. Um, so we, we got to make do without it. Girls volleyball, very doable list, was completely fine there. Baseball, um, I just cut out the batting cage on this order. Um, they'll be able to share some equipment with softball, so I didn't think the batting cage was needed right now. Definitely something I would love to have to help our athletes out, but just right now in the budget, we weren't able to do it, so we had to cut that out. Looking at girls' basketball, um, once again, they had a pretty doable list. They wanted also wanted a um, an automatic shooter, um, so we had to cut that out. And then instead of some – they wanted some major, pretty major quantity stuff, we cut that down a little bit as well to get those knocked down for girls basketball, as you can see here. I need to change this. Um, I'm going to change that before I turn this in. Um, boys basketball, very doable. We were good there for the most part. Like I said, I cut out a few small quantity stuff just to get those numbers down, and we were good to go. Softball was good. There was new uniforms, bats, um, catcher's gear, everything there was fine. Boys soccer and girls soccer, they both needed um, new soccer goals and nets. So instead of having them both purchased, Goals and nets, obviously. We just had the boys. I took it out of the boys' funding because the girls weren't going to spend as much. So took it out of there, and they're going to share those goals and nets. So the flip side, when we do need new goals and nets the next time, they'll come out of girls' funding. They're kind of the same team. Track and field was another huge purchase, but I was able to combine girls and boys into one. Um, obviously, we need new. We got to have high jump mats. We got to have um, pole vault mats. We got to have pole vault bars. We got to have standards for um, high jump new discus rings, new discus nets. All that. There's a lot of money that becomes around track, but it's boys team, girls team. They work together, practice together, same coaching staff. So they're all one team to me. So we saved um, some money there by cutting back a little bit on uniforms and stuff there because obviously the other stuff we have to have um, to compete. Um, cross country, um, we're kind of down to the nitty, the smaller amounts here. Um, boys, girls, cross country, all they needed was race medals um, for their big invitational and just to be able to fund that. Boys and girls golf, they were the same prices. I just asked the golf coach. They don't they don't really need a whole lot. The big thing is every three years they do need new team bags. We count those as uniforms. Um, the golf coach or our home golf course does supply balls and tees for them, so that helps out quite a bit. Tennis coach, he's the same coach for boys and girls. He only needed uh, tennis balls, really, and some super minor things. That was under a grand apiece. And then um, looking at swim as well, they just really needed – practice equipment and medals for their home meets. So we'll be keep those the same. So, like I said, um, total request was 153,000. Definitely to cut some things out. Um, we got it at 121 under our 125 bonus. Ideally as an AD, I would probably like to cut this down a little bit more, get it under that probably hundred range. That would still leave us 25 grand to do what we need with it. Um, Obviously, if most of these are first year for a brand new high school and we've got to buy a bunch of stuff from scratch, we're going to have to spend every bit of that 125 if not ask the school board for some more funding just to make sure we have the bare necessities for our athletes because not all these teams requested uniforms, um, all the necessary equipment, um, all that stuff. So if we were really to get into this and like if we had to start each and every sport that Mr. approves from scratch at a new high school, we would have to really um, get down nitty gritty and we're gonna need some more money than that. But based off the wish list and then just a um, couple years old um, order list from Platte County that I pulled for these other sports, um, we got it down to 121,000. So it worked out on our budget and uh, that's what I have here. So thank you.